I have a couple of Sunday swap updates for you. We now have the yield farming APR and also the 24 hour volume on Sunday swap decks as well as how to claim your Sunday token. So all these details coming right up. Yeah, yeah, gotta do it like that. You've been listening to the Learn Cardano podcast. Gotta get Hey everyone, I'm Peter Beery and I'm going through a couple of really quick updates in regards to Sunday Swap and how to actually claim your Sunday Swap tokens. But before we get into any of that, I just want to point out a couple of really key important things and a couple of people have been caught out by this and I really wanted to highlight the support request scams that are going around, especially on Twitter. Now, sometimes when you type in a wallet name, especially uh, in the Ethereum space, if you type in MetaMask onto Twitter, you'll get these automated reply bots that come in and say, oh no, I'm so sorry for uh, your technical issues that you're having, I'll help you out. And then we'll start and engage with you on a phishing scam and try and get your seed phrase from you so that they can open up your wallet on their computer and drain out all of your crypto assets. So I'm, I've been contacted by multiple people saying, I fell for this. I feel so bad that I have, and I, I'm generally sorry that it happened as well. But it's a process of education so that everyone out there knows that this is happening. There are scammers looking for your details and pretending to be authoritative figures, such as what you see here, or even this one here, which very much looked like Sunday Swap. They got the same logo, same everything. Uh, just the last word at the end was underscore Dex. They even had 8,800 followers, nowhere near what Sunday Swap had, which is around almost 300,000, but it looked legitimate enough and they're replying to tweets, they were doing all sorts of engagement to try and get your attention and falsify, support, and then hopefully get your uh, seed phrase from that. Now this has happened to lots and lots of people. Please do not fall for these support scams. The only way that you can get any kind of real support is via Discord and talking to the teams publicly in the general chats. So if you have a technical issue, talk to it there. No one will DM you, direct message you directly to talk about your issue. So don't fall for those. And whatever you do, do not enter your seed phrase, that 24 word or 15 word seed phrase that you used to set up your wallet anywhere online other than the official wallet where you've set things up. So please be careful. Your crypto assets are really important. Don't let them fall into anyone else's hands. Okay. So with that out of the way, the public service announcement, let's get into the details around how to actually claim your Sunday swap tokens. So this is the ISO claiming process. In one of my other videos, I, yeah, I, I did a clickbaity type of video that said, this is how you may be collecting your Sunday swap tokens. But in reality, it was exactly how you'd be collecting your Sunday swap tokens. They'll be using a service called Drip Drops, and you can check out the video there that demonstrates it and how you can actually go through the process of claiming tokens on the Drip Drops platform but they've teamed up with Drip Drops and you'll be able to now actually get your tokens after the March 1st. So at the end of February, the ISO period be over, they've collected all the data they need and then they can populate that within the Drip Drops system and distribute your tokens that way. So Drip Drops has a really optimized way of distributing the tokens to try and minimize and optimize how all those tokens are spread out across the ecosystem. So they're not spamming everyone's address with tokens so they can send out as many Sunday swap tokens as possible to as many addresses they can in one single transaction. So it's a really optimized way of doing it. Meld recently did their airdrop in a very similar way. Now, one of the major differences between the Meld airdrop and this one is that you need to actually pay for the claiming process. So it will cost you approximately three ADA to actually trigger the claiming process and you get 1.3 ADA back with your Sunday swap tokens. Now it will actually cost you ADA to actually trigger this process. So you need exactly three ADA to send to a particular address and that will trigger the process and send you back your Sunday swap tokens as well as a little bit of ADA for that particular transaction as well. The minimum amount that's needed to send a token. Now Drip Drops does take a very small fee in that as well as network fees as well. So keep that in mind. Now if you don't wanna pay these fees, 
you just have to wait a little bit longer for the Sunday Swap team to build out their own system where those fees will be even cheaper. So you just have to wait for that or take a little bit longer, but you have a whole year to be able to claim your Sunday Swap tokens. So there's no big rush in regards to doing this. But if you want to get your Sunday tokens quicker, you can use the drip drop system, collate them, and then provide liquidity to some of their pools so that you can yield farm within this ecosystem. And yield farming is what I want to talk about next. So the next major update that the Sunday Swap team have announced was that they now have the actual 24 hour volume and the yield farming APR within the interface of the DEX itself. So you can actually see how much is being traded within the DEX and how much potential rewards you'll get for providing liquidity. So up until now, we're blindly providing liquidity. Fingers crossed that we're actually earning some decent rewards. But yeah, we are, uh, it's a decent amount. So let me just pull that up. And here we can see the 24 hour volume here that is being moved within the actual liquidity pool and pair for Sunday and ADA. And if I click on this, I can now see the yield farming APR, which is 339%, which is huge. So um, I will quickly be adding some liquidity to this pool and uh, collating some of the fees and see what, what happens out of that. So it's fantastic now that we can actually see those details so we can make a better decision and judgment on what liquidity pools we want to provide liquidity for. Now, please keep in mind that there is that risk of impermanent loss when you're providing liquidity. So please don't blindly provide liquidity without knowing your risks and rewards within doing so. So now with all this value locked into the smart contracts, we're starting to see the numbers here on DeFi Llama and we can see the $86.3 million worth of uh, crypto assets locked into their smart contracts on their Sunday swap deck. So that's an incredible amount. Now we can actually zoom out a little bit further and have a look at the entire Cardano ecosystem and see how much has it's increased. We can see it's now up to 142 million uh, total value locked on the ecosystem, which is absolutely amazing. And that is because we've seen MELD, uh, the MELD project, um, their total value locked has been added into DeFi Llama as well. So that 42.7 million that came in from MELD from all of the staking uh, locked into their smart contracts. If you haven't done that yet, if you haven't staked your MELD tokens, check out the video link up there and you'll find out more about how to actually stake your MELD tokens into their protocol. So that is it for me for this video. Hopefully you got something out of it. Please be aware of those scams. They are rampant at the moment with all this DeFi space ramping up on Cardano. There's more and more of these scams appearing. So please be aware of them. Let other people know. The more people that know about it, the better. That way you may not be scammed or other people won't be scammed from these potential uh, scamming support things that are going around everywhere. Okay, that's it for me for this video. If you enjoyed this stuff, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, notification bell, and hear more from me real soon. Yeah, yeah, gotta do it like that. You've been listening to the Learn Cardano podcast. Gotta get it hype. Crypto is what we like. But this is not investment or financial advice. Gotta do your research, cause it's risky. We know it is. This show is educational and it's informative. Crypto's the future, really, it ain't no debate.